Xavier Scott was in court today. He and his 16-year-old girlfriend, Dominique Jackson, are both charged with capital murder. They allegedly met the victim, Tiffany Kelly, at the Dollar General, got a ride from her, then stabbed her and stole her car. Of three mates who love cars. Love that car. We argue constantly about what are the greatest racing cars. You know how much I love this thing. I don't know why you love it. God, I hate Ferrari so much. Now, we're taking that argument to the next level. Come on. There we go. Yay! In each show, one of us chooses a car. I'm going to touch it now for the first time. We learn about it. Dirty moth sat where I am. Meet the people who love it. I still got the trophy. And of course, drive it. Oh, God. <laughs> the boy's an idiot, isn't he? God, this is bad, to see if we can all agree once and for all which are the greatest racing cars of all time. That is unbelievable. Three men. Accused cold-blooded killers wanted the man's luxury SUV. So is this a part of a frightening new trend? This morning, police say these four men arrested late Friday night for their alleged role in the tragic holiday shopping mall carjacking might be part of it. Four suspects arrived in a Chevy Suburban SUV. They allegedly discovered Dustin and his wife, Jamie Friedland, leaving the mall. That's when investigators tell ABC News the carjackers struck. Jamie watching as her husband was fatally shot. Two men left in the Suburban. The other two sped off in the stolen Range Rover. After three adults were arrested, three more young men were arrested, charged with breaking into cars. Get really out of hands, and they're going to be breaking into people's houses next. Lather. Lather was caught breaking into a car by an undercover cop. Police say that he already has two open burglary cases against him and was currently out on bail. San Francisco police say they are making progress when it comes to property crime and say car break-ins are down. 14 burglaries are up 15 percent.